Today we're reacting to the entire history of Fortnite animated. We uploaded this four months ago and it already has 7.4 million views. It's probably gonna pass 10 million views, but now we're gonna watch it four months later and uh, see what the hype is all about. Fortnite is the biggest game in the world. The amount 10 of years ago, people like, got upset like about me this. saying Fortnite's the biggest game. They're like, actually Roblox. All right, third biggest get, game. In 2011, Epic Games is developing Fortnite Save the World and mm -hmm. it finally releases in 2017. It's doing all right, but it's not blowing up. What it was, it is was a blowing flop. up? It was a complete flop. Battle Royale. So Epic sees this and in just a couple weeks, they make a Battle Royale version of Save the World called Fortnite Battle, Battle Royale. Royale. Fortnite. 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 I love this little segment right here. Fortnite. 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 It's free. Fortnite. It's free. The way Nick 30 said that, bro, like he just knew that was going to be iconic. Whoa. At the start, nobody thinks this is going to be some massive game, but some gamers decided to actually give Fortnite a try. 100 players land on a massive, colorful map. You loot weapons and the zone slowly shrinks, forcing players to fight until it's just a 1v1. And everyone wants their first win. If you're in the last 1v1, remember, you are huh? literally shaking with nervousness. I was never so shaking. The guy you're facing. It might have taken you hundreds of tries, but every Fortnite player will remember that magical time it happened. But you know, the that time magical time that last kill is gone and now. got their first victory royale. The Even for a new player, because you play free. bots Fortnite in the beginning. Fortnite gained over 10 million so players easy in to its get a first win. month, and it would only get bigger with the release of Fortnite Season 1. The Slurp Juice is added, and for the first time ever, skins. Renegade Raider, Aerial Assault Trooper. There's now. Dude, I can't believe I didn't buy Renegade Raider or Aerial Assault Trooper or Raider. Like, I, I didn't buy it. I don't know why. I don't know what was going on in my head. The skin's ugly. It's just OG, but it's an ugly skin. Okay, I don't want to hear it. Now, an item shop where you can buy things with V-Bucks. But I mean, who's really going to spend money on Fortnite? I'll just save my money. And if the game gets popular, I'll just buy the skins later. I spent like. Almost $30,000 on Fortnite skins. I'm not even kidding. We also got Fortnite's Halloween event, which brought the Pumpkin Launcher, Gold Trooper, and Skull Trooper, which was instantly claimed by some kid named I'm I Am The, the Myth. Myth. Oh, look, he's kind of starting to learn how to build. And he just beat this big Twitch streamer by just bro, building this really higher takes and higher me back, on him. Bro. Maybe building is actually useful. Meanwhile, players figure out that instead of fighting, you can just hide in bushes and literally no you kind of wish that like the skill level never got as crazy as it got right now. Like, like it, it is impressive, but do you kind of wish that like there was like a lower cap that was like more manageable for people? Like you didn't have to have a part-time job playing Fortnite creative to keep up with the top builders. No one will notice. Other people want to hide in the sky. So why not make a big sky base and hope no one looks up? And what's this? Fortnite just released an update. They fixed a ton of bugs like the pump having infinite range that was and added wild. a new item, a launch pad. Epic just released this is, new This is when like I figured it out. For free? When they added the launch pad? This game's kind of different, huh? But it's about like to get a lot more that same day I made the trap it's tower. season two. Epic adds a small POI called Tilted Towers and a minimum of 80 people are landing there. Boogie Bomb is also here with the mini shield, the mini gun, silenced pistol, the crossbow, Fortnite couldn't miss. And even I got my big break by using a launch pad and some traps to make a trap tower. Oh yeah, there's also this guy who's getting kind of popular on Twitch. His name is Ninja. He's kind of the best player in the game right now. We got the first He really was back then, he really Black was. Black Knight and the Floss. Hey, hey, yo, Ninja, Ninja, is this enough movement? Players Damn. find a glitch where you can shoot we an RPG do him dirty at like your that. I'm sorry, and have him jump on it and ride the rocket. Instead of fixing the glitch, Epic makes it a part of their game. Meanwhile, a guy called Daquan figures out you can use two pump shots. What's crazy is even when the RPG was in the game last season, damage. barely any. Thankfully, anybody, Epic learned. I've from never, I've never seen someone rocket ride against me. It's always like the streamer is doing it for fun. I've never seen someone in a game actually do a rocket ride. It's always me doing it or a streamer doing it like rocket riding and decided to never ever remove double pump. There's now 45 million players on Fortnite, but that's nothing compared to Fortnite season three. This is Fortnite when just went mainstream. Serious. It's on the news. All your friends are playing. Everyone in your class is playing it. Even your grandparents are catching epic victory royales. Lucky landing, guided missiles, deagles, clingers, llamas. New battle pass is a banger. It has Rust Lord, take the L, but also the <laughs> infamous John Wick skin. At this point, fighting someone with a skin means they're a sweat. But if you ran Dude, into, a into John the Wick, John Wick was crazy. This is this is so funny. 
<laughs> Turbo building just got added and now building is much, much easier. Myth is camping in these new things called one by ones. And for the people actually playing the game, they're yeah. using ramp rushes to win fights. We had Everyone thought Fortnite was like at that, its huh? peak. But then Ninja plays Fortnite with Drake and shatters the Twitch viewership. That record. was kind of wild. Then he bro. hosts the first Fortnite tournament Ninja was on and a, breaks his record on again. Fortnite Friday is also here, a weekly tournament where duos race to get the most kills. Fortnite cannot be stopped. There should be nothing to worry about. But wait, there's this weird meteor in the sky, and it crashes into Dusty Depot in Fortnite Season Four. Dusty Depot is now Dusty Divot. There's Hop Rocks, Stink Bombs, Bro, Dusty bouncers, Divot was a POI, course, man. Shopping carts. Like, you could drop a new 30 kills in Dusty pass. Divot. The skins are okay, but the orange shirt kid finally got justice. <laughs> shopping cart challenge videos, covering Dusty Divot, clickbaiting the bunker, or just getting squad wins with the boys. Fortnite was the hot thing on the internet. But yeah. wait, no way. Thanos is now in Fortnite Bro. in their first ever collab? Everyone is scrambling, trying to land on the guy to become so Thanos because he's super overpowered. Ninja is pulling 100,000 live viewers because he's the best player, obviously. But there's this other guy that people say is even better. His name is Tifu. Tifu was on one as well back then, bro. Right, man was, on, man was doing some crazy on, stuff. But then Fortnite is telling everyone to log on and be in game at a certain time. And millions of people are attending the first live event in gaming history. One small step for man. Oh my god! What? Oh. This huge rocket launches, <laughs> flies around the map, and the crashes into the sky, event, causing man. a massive rift. Were you guys there? Were you guys there? Oh my god! Leading us into season five. Paradise Palms, Viking Village, ATKs, Lazy Links. Season 5 starts with a spray meta. The drum gun was broken. The silence SMG is the best AR. The P90 is the best SMG, shotgun, AR, sniper, Dude, all at once. That OG P90 was crazy. Flaws, but this was the peak of fun squad games. Tim, Courage, Ninja, and Lupo were always on getting Ws. And c and Fearless are actually uploading consistently. The summer skirmish <laughs> kicks off and we start to see who the real Fortnite pros are. Team Liquid popped off, but Aiden and Nick Merckx face off and tilted, but later unite and show everyone that you can actually compete against keyboard and mouse players on controller. But in the middle of the summer skirmish event, nah, a big the lightning strike Epic's hits. wild for this. Bro, is this, is this an event? They, they the did events the in the way. middle of the summer me? skirmish. What? Like in the middle of the Just tournament. They, they threw the cube in. And this massive purple cube spawns. Uh, the community quickly calls him Kevin. Kevin slowly rolls around the island and eventually falls into Loot Lake and melts into it, turning the lake purple and bouncy. Kevin the cube then rose back out of the lake, creating this huge floating island in Fortnite Season 6. There's now zombies on the map. There's six shooters, the shadow stones, quad crashers, and I hated the balloons, six shooter. spaz shotguns. But there's a new battle pass, but everyone only cares about a glitch with the calamity skin. At this point, hey. people are kind of <laughs> learning how to build and edit now. And people are using the forbidden fourth building slot that nobody used up until this point, the cones. And a new up and coming pro named Mr. Fresh Asian teaches Lachlan how to build a 90. Uh, what the like, hell like, was that? Cross platform comes <laughs> out and people are one shotting walls with the deagle and the heavy sniper. At the end of the season, we get another event. Kevin is unstable and explodes with energy, sending us to this weird white This was room a cool event. Where we meet and end up touching a butterfly. We don't really know what this means, but we're super excited for Fortnite season seven. Planes, oh, this rafts, music right drift here, boards, bro. frosty nah. flights, polar peak, and infantry rifle. We also get the addition nah. of creative mode. Scissors drops his death run map, and creators are losing their mind trying to finish it. But most people use creative to practice their building. This is the first time you really get sweats in Fortnite. The soccer skins, stretch res, there's now a divide between the good players and the casuals. TTV. God damn, I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! I told you! It's always the Twitch stream! We then get arena mode, glider redeploy, <laughs> siphon, and the marshmallow concert. But the biggest change was right before the Winter Royale, where they dropped I feel the, like the marshmallow concert is underrated. item. The Infinity Blade. For its time, oh, it's like crazy. You suck at the game! Oh my god! The sing, community's sing. not happy. It was a fun idea but it's way too strong and should not have been in a professional Fortnite tournament worth millions of dollars. <laughs> then the Ice King, who had slowly been gathering energy in his little ball, 
sends a massive ice storm over the map and covers the map in ice. Now we're in Fortnite. I love the season eight. voice. And there's a huge volcano on the map for some reason. There's a pirate they actually tease the pass, volcano. Lazy Lagoon, treasure maps, cannons, flintlocks, no one bumbos, noticed. and ballers. And Fortnite would shock everyone, announcing this thing called the World Cup with a $30 million prize pool. Bizzle qualified by hiding in a baller all game. Tim actually almost qualifies, but ties to fall damage. Dang. I died! He needed one this more point. This new guy clicks qualifies easily by W key. No, he wasn't going to qualify for the World Cup. So he didn't qualify before the World Cup. For it's round time two. for the unvolting live event. They're floating in. Yo, I'm going in. It's thirty million dollars, and then they, the there was ten million for creative. That's why the number was off. Item to bring back to the game. There's the planes, the sword, the bouncers, and of course, you can oh guess what the default pick. Bro, they no, love that no. drum gun, bro. What are you doing? Oh, no. But then we were teleported into the sky. I wonder the volcano like, was erupting and it shot it a massive fireball and completely destroyed Tilted Towers. Bye bye, Tilted. No! <laughs> the island was in chaos and Jonesy, the main character in the Fortnite cinematics, goes into hiding. Years later, he emerges from his bunker in Fortnite Season 9. Neo tilted, Mega Mall, Slipstreams, Chug Splashes. Season 8 was pretty good, so as long as they don't make any huge changes before the World Cup, this season's gonna be great. No more pumps. Combat shotgun. They replaced the pump with the combat shotgun, and it was pretty controversial, but players get time to use it before the Fortnite the, the World OG Cup. The OG combat Only was the pretty, best pretty nice. Only players in the world qualify for a chance at $30 million. Surely these guys are only the most alpha, most experienced esports super athletes in the world. Actually, it was mostly 15 year olds with minimal social skills. <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> Thankfully, a 15-year-old with decent Ugh. social skills won. Booga dominated everyone and was crowned the World Cup champion and won Booga $3 really dominated, million. Bro. He really dominated. And parents around the world realized that gaming wasn't a waste of time. Meanwhile, back on the map, Booga. there's now a pressure plant in the volcano, and they've built this big mech. Apparently, there's been a giant monster okay, in the water probably outside my the favorite island, event and they of face chapter off one. the monster versus mech event. That is so scary! Oh my God. <laughs> Crap, dude. The monster grabs the zero point, but the mech comes out of nowhere and stabs him in the eye. But after Imagine the event, the zero point wasn't when, safe underground anymore. When the black the hole event happens, the island, and now it's raw Fortnite energy actually is like causing the island shut to down for like two fast. years. Welcome to season X. And then it came back out. And like, things were definitely two. unstable. OG Dusty Depot was back. There's a huge meteor I'm not saying in the sky. They should have done that, but imagine if they did. You can turn into props in Paradise Palms, which is now half swamp. Tilted is Wild West now, and you can't build there. Just kidding. It's Gotham City now. There's a Borderlands Wait, POI where you can shield Tilted constantly. Towers change three times. And there's also times. the mechs. They three are times. crazy broken and require almost no skill to get wins. Fortnite is in a rough spot with the hashtag vault the mech trending on socials. The community said, we want the OG Fortnite map back, not this mess of tacos, mechs, and zombies. And thankfully, Fortnite was way ahead of them. They announced an event called The End. And for the first time, we see the seven. There's seven characters who have escaped the game of Fortnite, but we have no idea what that means. They use their rocket ships and send the meteor crashing to the zero point, creating Fortnite a giant lore. black hole, pulling everyone into the map, and then nothing. And then I had 155,000 people watching me for 48 hours straight while I stared at a black hole and read numbers out loud and tried to just decipher what the black hole meant. The black hole, and everyone is just staring at it. And I gained like no 10,000 really subscribers. No one really knows what's going on. Are we going to a new map? Is the old map coming back? Is Fortnite gone forever? After a long two-day wait, we finally were able to play. Some kids we were freaking out, bro. Fortnite Those clips of kids two. freaking out was hilarious. Oh God, I've waited literally two days for this moment. Oh, it's beautiful. A brand new map, new fishing, swimming, boats, the mythic goldfish, upgrade benches, all new POIs, new items. The season had a super hot start. What's in that weird bunker? When is the Kraken event happening? When are the updates? No, seriously. When are the updates? Bro, this That's right. Is, For uh, some reason, Epic this is Strategy so was bad. to stop the updates. We got almost no that was new like, guns or updates We went from like one. the craziness of Season X to like Till the, ta like, the Towers literally changed three times in Season X to like only the Harpoon gun happening 
in season one, chapter two. Due to delays, and it ended up being Fortnite's longest season ever. There was so little content that it forced us to make our own. <laughs> the fashion Overall, show it wasn't a great start to the chapter, but that would all change in chapter two, season two. Mythic items, a super memorable battle pass. The if ABC chapter two, Sharks, season two, Pulse, Henchman, didn't get delayed, fire, SMGs, helicopters, it could easily be like and the Travis top Scott two seasons the of all time. Fun, and there was a massive top surge two. in viewership and players as lockdowns around the world forced people to stay inside and get some dubs. And people started approaching the skill ceiling as we discovered peace control, a high level way to play Fortnite that would leave the defaults in the dust. Streamers were excited for the new map, but quickly got bored of killing the same AI players every game and started moving on to other games. Controller aim assist was the most broken it's ever been this season. Keyboard players said that aim assist was basically cheating and controller players said, yeah, but you guys have your entire arm to aim. Meanwhile, <laughs> underneath the agency, Midas was building a device, a device to stop the storm from closing. It what was he cooking, bro? What was Midas shot out cooking? Beams that prevented the storm from closing, but a surge of white energy transported us into this weird white office. We met Agent Jonesy. They initiated their backup plan, though, and transformed the storm into a massive wall of water. Okay, that was scary. It. This is the first time, especially Fortnite seeing like really the sharks in the storm. The in the lore, the game this is probably of the scariest is moment in Fortnite loop, history. And we're all when the storm turned into land, like a flood. Eliminate people. The storm closes and then it all resets. Agent Jonesy works for a secret organization called the imagined order and their job is to protect the zero point and keep the loop of fortnite going the water on the storm had to go somewhere yeah it was like the that for whole three days. map was flooded in chapter two season three it slowly drained though week by week revealing more and more of the map which felt super fun unlike the last two seasons this season was short and sweet and had a ton of new changes more mythics and more vaults the authority the fortilla caddy corner flare guns fire cars the authority was kind of mid favorite the POI, agency. coral castle but overall this was Bro, a really coral fun castle season. survived the community the was really entire loving chapter two. Oh, now there's the charge shotgun Unfortunately, the pace of the game started to feel L charge real slow. There wasn't many fights to be had, and the gameplay started to slow down. Halfway during the season, Epic Chunky shocked PK, the bro. world when they sued Apple. Big, complicated legal thing, but unfortunately, Fortnite Mobile was removed. But Fortnite wasn't done yet. They dropped one Dude, of their biggest seasons So Fortnite hasn't had mobile ever. for, what, Chapter like three two, years now? Season four. A huge new years. Stark Industries biome. The pump is finally back. Stark Rifle, Unibeam, Group Baller, Thor's Hammer, Doctor Doom Mythics. There was a ton Didn't of Group Baller only last like a week incredible. before they vaulted it? Fortnite players noticed Galactus getting bigger oh, and my bigger in the part. sky during the season. We thought it was over. He was coming for the zero point and he was going to completely destroy the island. The but anime what scene. happened was very different. <laughs> Dude, we popped off on this video, huh? Who animated this? My animation team. And he was gone. The guy that can eat entire <laughs> planets just ate a few battle buses. Okay, and it was up. a few million battle buses. People again. were so this time Bro, the the Galactus defenders were up in the comments, bro. They were like, bro, he didn't eat a few battle buses. He ate a billion, bro. Like, of course. And it's Tony Stark. He's so smart. I'm, instead of destabilizing the map, we got chapter two, season five. The zero point brought literally every collab you can think of, including uh, fan <laughs> favorite, Chun Li. The map is covered in sand and you can tunnel around in it. Uh, well, it only worked for two weeks though. Bando sniper, exotic items, there's a Coliseum, gold system, NPCs. Tilted is back. Well, kinda. This season had a really promising start. The pump is gone for the lever shock. <laughs> and the updates the just lever is weren't so hitting. mid. The community thought season five was uh kind of mid, but it's all good. Chapter two, season six. All good. Is here. Chapter two, season six is here. Our boy no Jonesy way. Abandons the IO. No way. Just opened it like that. Meets up with the foundation in a preseason It's all good, guys. One of the worst seasons we've ever had. The, the worst There's season we've ever had in Fortnite history is here. weapons, bows, recyclers, and a big spire in the middle of the map. But overall, this season wasn't that well received. People didn't really like the primal weapons, and the makeshift weapons were even worse. But in chapter two, season seven, aliens have invaded the map and there's this massive mothership in the sky. New UFOs, Gravitrons, prop guns, Chimera SMGs, the railgun, recon scanner, 
Fortnite was killing it with the updates. POIs are getting sucked up by the aliens, season. but the IO have a plan. When they abduct the next POI, they're going to attach bombs to it and send players into the mothership and detonate it. Looking back, uh, I don't know why we agreed to this since we ended up getting betrayed and that was pretty obvious. But you know what's funny? You see that Superman skin and the alien skin? Those two skins aren't randomly picked. Those two skins were in the room with me when I was doing the event. Like they were, they were next to me when I was doing the event. We were saved if you actually go Kevin. watch me like attending oh, the event. You hugged the Kevin? Oh my God. Uh, Kevin is now nice. He's blue. He's finally back. The plan worked and the mothership crashed down onto the island raining cubes, leading us into chapter two. Yeah, I was telling Superman eight. to help. I was like, Superman, the what are you going to do? The bro? mothership is now on the island and. Bro, why'd they make the, the queen like. Look like this, bro. I don't know. <laughs> Corrupting it. There's this new sideways area with zombies that almost no one really cares about. The updates were okay. We got Naruto, but the community was getting bored. Thankfully, we had late game arena to tide us over, but people were really getting bored of the chapter two map. But suddenly there were rumors, rumors about Fortnite chapter three. And what do you know? Fortnite announced the end okay, event. I really two. wish this event didn't get leaked. And the whole squad is like the map flipping, us, but the seven and the like foundation who ends up being dude, they actually uploaded the map flipping on TikTok. Like they actually uploaded the end of this event on TikTok. I saw it first thing in the morning when the event was going to go down. I saw it first thing in the morning. The first thing I saw, I opened Twitter. I see the map flipping. I'm like, oh my God, Epic, please. Rock, execute a plan to that flip was crazy. the entire island to stop the queen. Bringing us into Fortnite chapter three. And now here we are in Fortnite chapter three. Chapter three, season one was an amazing start to the chapter. It was, we had it really was. Spider-Man mythics, clombos, brand new POIs, tornadoes and storms, but nothing could prepare us for what Epic has in store next because Fortnite chapter three, season two is here and Epic did the unthinkable. They removed building for two weeks. And this season, the IO and that the was seven crazy. are in an all out war. The IO build the collider and plan to destroy the island. But thankfully, the seven had a plan. They've been rebuilding the mech on the moon. And during the collision event, it comes the to collision save event was also the really island. Lit. I like we it. take out the collider, defeat Sloan and the IO and get a tease at the next villain, Geno, which takes us to season three. After months of war, it's time to just vibe. There's a yep. new reality tree biome, rideable animals, but all this time we're being watched by the Herald. She lays low, but puts her plan into motion in season four. The island is being taken over by okay, I did, Chrome. I did not like the Chrome. It's infecting the entire nope. map, but also the brings Chrome us a was ton not of new content. And the Goon Gun was ridiculous. I finally got to join the Fortnite Icon Woo! series. Yeah, the Herald's that's plan what it's is about, all baby. leading up to a huge live event for the fate of the island and could be the end of Fortnite Chapter 3. While this chapter of the Fortnite story may be over, I have so a feeling awesome. we're still just at the very beginning of the story of Fortnite. Guys, subscribe it's for more Cypher Reacts content. Yes, I'm reacting to my Fortnite. own content because and I'm running day, out of ideas. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Might this end. video is worth reacting to. Come on. But now. Hit that like button and subscribe. The we've made here together will last, last forever. forever. Thank, Thank you for watching. watching.